Hey guys, um, me and my family just got back from our Kwanzaa celebration and we had a wonderful time. Um, <laughs> I know I'm just a little weird, but oh well. Uh, <laughs> anyway, the Kwanzaa celebration is open to everyone. It is um, an African American celebration um, and it's really, really fun and it's open to everyone. If you're African American, if you're not African American but interested in learning a little bit more about um, African American culture, then I would suggest next year you plan on visiting a Kwanzaa celebration. <laughs> anyway, um, I'm going to insert some clips from the Kwanzaa celebration. A lot of it will be dance, but there were other um, performers there. There were people that sang. There were speakers there. And unfortunately, I don't have any video that's actually good enough to put on there because I use my phone. So we don't have any of the speakers, but we do have um, some of our... We have the dancers and we have a few singers on there and at one um, at the end you get to see a young man who is very inspiring and I think his story is wonderful. Um, as well as my little boy, you get to see him dancing and um, as you can see Dee Dee's here mouthing me <laughs> and acting up. But um, I hope you guys enjoy. Bye.
food and I didn't videotape the food. I'm sorry. I did eat though. <laughs> and I hope you enjoy my little boy's dancing. He is so cute. I think it's so cute. Him trying to do those African dances. And we are not the most coordinated people in the world. So yeah, dancing is just not us. So to see him, and this is my daughter D, but to see him try and just enjoy himself and just let go is just really great. So thanks for watching and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.